welcome back to another video and the sun is in my eyes <laughs> so yeah welcome back to a new video i'm ellen equestrian and today i'm just doing a <laughs> i'm just doing like a barn vlog type thing um i've tried to film this three times every time somehow it goes wrong so let's start off by letting the chickens out um so yeah I hope you enjoy today's video. Like I said, I've tried to film this three times. Every time, it's gone wrong. So let's hope we can get it today. So the feed's out, uh, let's check it out. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below what you'd like to see on my next video. Um, because I'm kind of running out of ideas. So why don't you guys help me? Thank you for watching. Uh, today I am riding poops, but yes, did, no, two days ago um, I got it on my GoPro, which I'm going to use um, because today I think I'm just going to do some flat work um, just to get in listening more because that's what we've been mainly doing most of the time. I did do a little jump yesterday, I need a lot more control, but sadly my mum didn't video, so a bit sad. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go to the Apples and do things like that. <laughs> so I do know what happened to the audio in this clip. I do not know what happened, um, but I just talk about Rupert going out in the field, um, naked. Um, and yeah, just, I don't know what else. <laughs> also, Rupert is so handsome. I remember saying that. So this is their feed, um, Spud gets a one cup of pony nuts but today I decided to give him one cup and a half so he got one cup in his bowl and then the other half in that bowl and then put the other half in Spud's bowl um, so the bowl he has for tea and then the bowl he has for lunch, uh, breakfast, uh, breakfast yeah <laughs> and then Roots just gets one cup of pony nuts and he gets a cup and a half so. so next i get the chop chaff whatever you want to call it it has molasses in it we don't normally give spud molasses but it's a little treat because i have some sad news but i'm not saying anything so they both get a little handful of it um so yeah and then they both get a like spoonful of powder and then water down just because i don't like it like not watered
Um, so I did properly warm my makeup up first before this, but this is the clips I've got um, from my GoPro. I hope you enjoy, and um, every now and again I'm just going to pop in do a bit of a voiceover. So I did start with poles, um, but I just raised them up um, because I just wanted to see what he was going to do. Um, so yeah, I'll let you watch these few clips. So after cantering around a bit I came over them for the first time, I was going to trot over them but he was a bit confused so I just let him walk over them which was absolutely fine with me, I wasn't bothered. Um, so we came back around again, I did that a couple of times as well but I cut it out because it was a bit boring. Uh, so we come trotting up to it, he wanted to cant but I was like no, nope. and then he was like what do I do? He was a bit confused, he rushed after but that's okay, that's completely fine, we're still learning. Um, and he's more of a fan of jumping than poles. He doesn't find poles the funnest, but he still has to learn. Yeah, he proper like spooked himself. I think he jumped over that then, um, but I can't really remember because it was a few weeks ago. Uh, so we did do a lot more on that rain, but I cut it out again. Um, and then I went on the other rain, had him a little canter around. He's definitely got much more controlled with his canter. Like he's so listening to me a lot more. Um, but here I was trying to stop him, and he was like, he still runs away, but he does. He's getting not as strong now, so that's good. <laughs> and again on the other rain. Um, I was gonna, I did walk him over it a couple of times, but again, I cut that out because it's a bit boring. Um, so yeah, we did do that a couple of times, and then I just because he kept jumping it then, but I don't know where those pups have gone. Um, I walked him over it to say you have to not jump it. It's not a jump. Every time I went up to it, I don't know if you can hear, but I say it's not a jump. It's not a race. You have to chill. Um, but yeah, he's getting much better. We're getting more confidence together. Um, so yeah, I come at it again, he wants to jump it, I'm like, no, so he does jump it, but I was like, Roops, you got to listen to me now, um, but that was fine. Uh, so my mum actually made them a bit wider, uh, which was good because he kind of listened, he still cantered after, but that's Rupert, <laughs> he likes to go fast, he doesn't know what the word slow means. <laughs> So yeah, I did do that a couple of times on this rain and the other rain, so I'll let you watch these clips. Now my mum just put both poles on the floor because he just kept jumping them, um, but he, he worked quite well. Um, he listened a lot more, um, He just needs, we just need to work on little things like tweaking our canter and trot, which he's got better on the flat, but jumping, not so much because he just gets so excited after the fence and he wants to gallop round. Um, so yeah, we do this a couple more times in both rooms, but again, I crop some of it out because it can get a bit boring just watching the same thing over and over again. I know I don't like watching the same thing over and over again. So yeah, I did do this a lot more times, but again, um, I just didn't want to overdo you know what I mean. Uh, so yeah, and then pulled him up and he was a really good boy. So uh, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. Comment down below what you'd like to see in the next video. Because, again, I'm running out of ideas. And I'm sorry this video is late once again. 
I have tried to edit it quick enough, but sometimes I just can't be bothered. <laughs> so yeah, again, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please like and subscribe and go check out my Instagram. So thanks for watching. Bye.